Chris. <laughs> Hi, Eric. How's it going, man? Good. How are you? I'm pretty good. Uh, where are you located? I'm in um, outside of Minneapolis. Okay, cool. Is it awesome there? Yeah, it's fine. I mean, none, none of the dangerous stuff came our way, so that's good. Good. So that's nice. Wait, is that a Blondie shirt you're wearing? Yeah, it's vintage from amazing. 1980. That's <laughs> amazing. My wife and I went to see Blondie live with Garbage uh, a couple of years ago, and oh. it was an awesome show. Yeah, I really want to see them in concert, too. They're fantastic live, dude. Uh, yeah. She she is like watching her on stage. Is it's like watching somebody. It's like watching performance art. She's she's lovely. Yeah, All right. So, uh, what what can I do for you, man? You got you got questions for me, or what's up? Well, I just wanted to thank you a lot for your role as Yuki in the original series and um, the remake, because that really potentially saved my life when I was growing up because I would come home um, from getting severely bullied even when I was like 12 and 13 and I would take solace in um, specifically well, Toru, Laura Bailey and your cadence and the gentle Casey? It looks like he just disconnected. He should be reconnecting again. I see okay. his little his little green dot, and so we're just waiting for him to. Okay. I don't want to kick him because you guys have already started talking. No, and no, so... no, 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 I just, I just, I never, I never know if it's um, <laughs> there. He is on my end or not because my my internet is uh, very spotty where I am. Okay, there yeah. he is. Hey, buddy. There he is. There we go. Well. Yeah, I, I heard I heard what you're saying. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I I mean, you're welcome, man. I, I appreciate that. It's it's very it, it's it's heartwarming to know that I can be a part of your life in a way that you know I wouldn't have known until now. It's very. I'm I'm glad that I could. I'm glad that I could have yeah. helped in some small way. And then, um, my main hobby is collecting uh, production art and may cells and actually have um scene where he's um wearing a dress and pretending to oh be wow. cute to um, distract people from their yeah. yeah I don't know if you can see it very well I can see it I can see it enough to see yeah that's amazing oops Yeah, that's that's a that is some amazing art, man. Uh, I mean, I'm I'm I can't believe that uh, I can't believe you have that. I've never even I've never seen I've never seen that before. Not at the studio or anywhere. I won't. I have a I have a couple of cells myself here, but it's from a show called Blue Gender. But that's all all, all I've oh, ever yeah. been to get my hands on. You know, so that's pretty kick ass. Yeah, I, I think. I figured that you probably didn't see production art from Fruits Basket before. <laughs> no, 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 never. That's the first time I've seen it. That's pretty awesome, man. I mean, especially with the resurgence of the new series going on. So that's pretty killer. Yeah, because I didn't know. I wanted to go to Daisho Con last time you were here, and then I didn't know until the last second. Daisho um, yeah. <clears throat> What was that? That was in Wisconsin Dells. Yes, yes, Wisconsin Dells. Okay, yeah, that was that was a good time. We had some good fun with some good people there. So, yeah, because it doesn't seem like a lot of voice actors I'm a fan of don't really come up to the this area. Well, you know, I think what it comes down to is right now there's there's so many more voice actors than there ever has been. You know, like when I started voice acting 20 years ago, there wasn't yeah a lot. And now there's a ton of us. So every convention has so many different options. Uh, I, the key is just keep hitting that convention with all of your. There we go. Um, there you are. So I was saying that the key is keep hitting that convention with all of your suggestions for the guests that you want to see. Yeah. 
Uh, it'll make um, it uh, easier. Oh yeah, to and get then one other thing. It'll make it, yeah. yeah. There was one other thing. Um, I actually saw your one of your short films, um, Soul Possessions. I think is that the name of it? Yeah. 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 Uh, that was really cool because I'm a I'm a fan of um psychological horror especially so i thought that was really well done oh thanks man i i, I yeah i i love psychological horror too um keep uh keep yeah follow me on twitter if you don't already because i'm about to i'm about to post uh all of my shorts at least and maybe a couple of other things uh, uh online for free so you can have some stuff to keep yourself entertained while we're all locked down oh okay great yeah, you got it, man. Um, was there any other questions you had? Yeah, there was one more, actually. Um, there yeah. was something I don't think I've ever seen you get asked. when, Way back when you were doing Yuki for the original Fruits Basket, did you... I know this might be a silly question since he was voiced by um, a female in Japanese, but did you, did you base your performance off of that at all, or did you just completely approach it originally? Uh, I, I I wouldn't say that I based the performance off of it, but but I I do use the Japanese performance as a guide as to uh, and a, sort of an emotional guide of of where where the emotions need to go to. But as far as the full performance and the voice, I I just leave that up to me. Okay. Yeah. That's cool. Well, yeah, thank well, you. Yeah, man, it's my pleasure. It's great talking to you. And uh, I, yeah, stay safe up there. I know everything's crazy right now, but uh, wear your mask and, and hopefully I'll see you at a con very soon. Yeah, thanks. Have a good night. All right, you too, buddy. Take care. Bye.